Once upon a time, there was a little tooth called. Can you guess? Well, little tooth. He was not much older than you, but he was very naughty. Even so, his mother loved him dearly, and every day she tried to teach him lots of things he needed to learn. The thing that upset her the most was that little tooth never wanted to wash himself. Mrs. Toothbrush and Mrs. Toothpaste would call on him every day, but as soon as he saw them, he would run away and hide. Every day, his mum told him, "Little Tooth, it's morning. Wake up, go to the bathroom and wash." Oh, I'm so sleepy. I only just woke up. I'll wash later. After every meal, Mother told him, "Little Tooth, go brush yourself. Use the toothbrush and the toothpaste." One day the acids will come and attack you, and they're sure to cause decay. Oh, my friends have just arrived, and they want me to play with them. I can't brush now. Later. In the evening, right before going to bed, his mother told him, "Little tooth, go and wash. It's warm and dark at night. The bacteria will all come out, and they are going to damage your beautiful enamel." I'm so sleepy. I'll wash tomorrow. I promise. And so on every day, but one morning, Little Tooth was playing in the park with his friends. Acids and bacteria were hiding all over the place, ready to attack. When Little Tooth ran to a bush to fetch a ball, the acids and bacteria, all at the same time, jumped onto him and started to nibble his enamel. Help! Help! cried Little Tooth, but his friends ran away home frightened. Mrs. Toothpaste and Mrs. Toothbrush, who were taking a nice walk in the park at the time, rushed to the rescue. Quickly, they started to clean Little Tooth up and remove the acids and bacteria. They rinsed him with water. Little Tooth was now sparkling clean. Thank you, ladies. From now on, I'm going to take my mother's advice and brush every day. And this is how Little Tooth got rid of his problem. Not a day passed without him brushing, and he lived healthily until a grand old age.